start with our e.l.f. eyelid primer, which is a really good drugstore primer. Just put this all over your eyelids and in your inner corner and just blend that all in gently. Next, taking my iStudio Cozy Cashmere Quad, I'm going to be taking a flat brush and putting the lightest shade all over my lid. Next, taking the other side of the brush, I'm going to be taking the second shade in the quad and putting this all over the outer corner of my eye, kind of halfway. Next, with a blending brush, I'm just going to make sure there's no harsh lines with these colors and just really make sure they're blended well. Then with this tiny kind of pencilish looking brush, I'm going to be taking the last shade in the quad and just putting this all along my crease, but really tap these colors off because they have a lot of payoff. So you just don't want to have that all over your face and just kind of put that in your crease, just drawing where your crease would be. Next, with the same blending brush, just blend that all in together so that there's no harsh lines and that it all just looks really well blended and nice. Next, this is an optional step, but I'm taking my MAC Brulee eyeshadow. It's just a matte. Uh, under brow highlighting with this like really fat kind of matte MAC brush and just putting this all under my brow just because I don't have a matte drugstore uh, under eye color and next with my NYX milk uh, cream pencil thing I'm just going to put this in my inner corners and mine's kind of like completely gone but you know what just put whatever works in your inner corner I just really like the way that this turns out Next with my Physicians Formula Eyeliner, I really love this eyeliner, it gives a really precise line. I'm just going to put a normal size, not winged or anything, uh, line just to add a little definition to my eye. Next just go ahead and curl your eyelashes and apply mascara. Moving on to cheeks, I'm using my NYX Mocha Blush, and I'm just going to put this all over my cheeks. It's a really gorgeous blush color. It's my favorite right now, so just make sure you tap it off because it's very pigmented. Finally moving on to lips, I'm going to be taking my favorite drugstore lipstick. This is in Lovely Rouge and I'm just going to apply this over my lips. It's by Milani. It is such a gorgeous color and it's really in that trend of the dark lips. And you can use a different lip color if you're not into this whole dark lip trend, but these are super moisturizing and the color's not that crazy, so it's perfect for the trend. And that is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will talk to you all later. Bye.